Okay, here it is. I'm here. Um, there's nothing really major to update on. So I'll first start by telling you what I've been doing for the past month. Um, I did make a video right before I left for the training, but I didn't get a chance to upload it. So yeah, I kind of left you all hanging, but yeah, me and my husband, we basically, basically before I left, we've just been taking time off to enjoy ourselves, um, together and learning to, you know, grow closer together with God and everything. So just taking time out, you know, not thinking about, oh, we gotta, you know, have sex on this day or OPKs or prenatal vitamins even I didn't even take those and I just took time to just relax and enjoy myself prayer fasting and just trying to build you know their relationship with God and grow closer with my husband through God um but yeah so now when I left for the training the training is actually uh, like a readiness training and so it was it was difficult in a sense where we couldn't shower for a certain period of time and I think that in in my opinion that was the most difficult part about the training but um, I'm back now and I have showered but um, yeah so but during the training, I, I didn't have my phone. I didn't, I couldn't, um, I had the internet, but it was for like work purposes only. So I had limited access to the internet and I didn't have my phone. I couldn't, you know, so yeah. So I've been back a week now. Um, so while I was there, of course, me and my husband, we didn't baby dance during that month because I was gone and uh and luckily um well when I got back my cycle started so this is kind of like a new cycle I am on cycle day eight so um ovulation should be next week sometime I'm not sure if I'm going to take OPKs or not I haven't decided but I haven't been taking those previously. Um, yeah. So. Didn't lose any weight. I'm the same weight. Everything's still the same. Me and my husband are just here. Enjoying ourselves. Relaxing. Um, I'm not sure if we'll go back to um, the fertility clinic soon or we're just gonna you know just wait a little while longer I feel like me and my husband are you know growing together you know not any no no marriage is perfect and so I feel like we definitely have room to improve everyone does and I think that you know taking this time oh you know away from focusing on baby dancing and everything has given me and my husband time to focus on you know God and focus on our marriage and building that and strengthening that and building a foundation there um a stronger one because we were, we were doing okay before not just you know but everybody has room for improvement so um yeah so we're doing good um he's at work right now it's actually pretty late in the night well not late late for me <laughs> Well, my husband had to work late today, so I said I'd come on here and make a video because I've been taking this time, you know, enjoying him and, and being, you know, back with him after this month-long training. And work hasn't really decreased any, as I expected it would, but it did not. So I, I still have probably just as much work. Hopefully, the workload will be decreasing soon. Um, and then I can just go back into, you know, school and focus on school and finishing my degree before, you know, as I prepare for my transition out of the military in a couple of years or so. Um, 
yeah, so I'm trying to think what else is there to say. Let me think. Um, I started taking my prenatal vitamins again once I got back. Um, I take, oh yeah, and I, and I'm actually considering taking other vitamins. So, some of them off the top of my head that I've been thinking about were the soy flav, flavones, something like that. But I kind of, I googled that and I looked it up and I was like, I'm not having any problems with, um, my cycle. Or anything, and then I was looking looking that up, and it said that you know we could um, well women who don't usually have problems with their cycle have you know can mess up their cycle by taking that that uh, supplement. Then the, um, there's another one, CQT and I don't know. I was looking at that too. I wanted to try those too because I started thinking about different stuff like you know this whole diagnosing yourself thing again but um yeah um just thinking like what could be wrong but maybe there's nothing wrong so I'm not really focusing too much on it but I did consider maybe there is something else out there eating better maybe I should eat better diet I don't know um but I am doing good. My husband's doing good. My dogs are doing good. Um, and we are here. And actually, I want to give a shout out to all of those who got their big fat positives while I was gone. I've been watching your videos. And um, yeah, congratulations to all of you. I am so excited for you all. It, 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 really, it really makes me happy to know, you know, that people who go through the same thing that I go through, you know, can get their positive out of there. And I know I'm coming up soon. So keep making your videos, your pregnancy vlogs, and I'll follow you throughout your whole pregnancy. And if you make more vlogs after that, I'll continue to follow you because <laughs> now I'm, I'm connected to you in a sense. So if you continue to make videos, that is. So, um, but yeah, thanks for watching. I, I don't really have any updates. Maybe I'll update you if I decide to take an OPK, OPK. <laughs> then I'll come back on here and give you an update then. Or if my husband comes back and he wants to make a video, then uh, then maybe I'll come back on here for that too. But thanks for watching.